Today we're going to cover the benefits of the Maximerge 5E electric drive row unit. You'll see we're using common components that are proven on the Exactor Merge line of row units, such as the row unit controller and the 56 volt drive motor that's installed on each and every row unit. This provides curve compensation to improve population accuracy up to 20% around curves. It also provides row command built in without the need for individual clutches on every row. You'll also see a clean toolbar without the need for shafts, sprockets, and chains requiring that maintenance needed on those items. The other benefit of Maximerge 5E is it provides compatibility for some of the new features you see here such as pneumatic closing wheels, individual row hydraulic downforce or IRHD, and the easy adjust pneumatic row cleaner. Now we're demonstrating the main run page that you'll see for Seedstar 3 HP, which is included as standard equipment on the new Maximerge 5E electric drive planters, which were introduced in 2017. Across the top, you'll see we're looking at population. Uh, one of the main features with Maximerge 5E is curve compensation, which we're going to demonstrate here. What I'll do is I'm going to turn curve compensation off to demonstrate what it looks like if you would not have the feature. What we're looking at here, it, this indicates if we're going straight or turning right and left. So what I'll do is I'll begin to make a turn to the right and keep in mind we're watching our population here. And you'll see as we make a turn to the right, our outside row on the left is, is going faster but it's not compensating for it. So this is a traditional planting experience when going around a curve. Now we're, we're curving back. We're starting to curve to the left, so you'll see how the uh, it's going to be high on the inside of the turn and low on the outside. So now if I go back and I turn curve compensation meter control on, this would be how you would normally run in the field. It's going to compensate those curves and it's going to adjust each meter individually for optimum performance. So now we can we can make a turn to the right again. You'll see now it's green indicating that it's actively controlling for that curve. And you'll see we've got a pretty nice straight line across maintaining that accurate population. Now we curve to the left still maintaining consistent population across the planter. So along with curve compensation that you see here, you also get maintenance-free design, eliminating chains and sprockets, and just overall uh, more accurate population control as compared to a ground drive or hydraulic drive planter. So for all those features, see your John Deere dealer for availability and pricing information.